Jehoshaphat raised the level of his devotion to the Lord by devoting himself to the teaching of God's word. So if we want to increase our devotion to the Lord's ways, then we need to devote ourselves to the teaching of God's word. Jehoshaphat did that personally. Jehoshaphat did not consult the Baals, but he sought the God of his father and followed his commands rather than the practices of Israel. How did he do that? He had access to the word of God so that he could read the word of God, so that he could study the word of God, so that he could obey the word of God. And he took time in the word of God. He did not consult the Baals or the prophets of the Baals. He sought the word of God and the prophets of the Lord God. Jehoshaphat saw, however, that it was not enough for him to know God's word. He wanted God's people to know God's word. If God's word was going to prosper him, he wanted it to prosper the people too. And so he, he saw that the teaching of God's word occurred throughout the realm of his kingdom, through all of Judah. And that's what we find in verse 7 through 10. He sent his officials to teach in the towns of Judah. He sent with them in verse 8 certain Levites and priests. And these Levites and priests and officials, according to verse 9, taught. What did they teach? They taught the word of God throughout Judah. How did they do it? They had a copy of the book of the law of the Lord with them. <laughs> you know, they didn't go and just say, this is what the Lord says. No, they, they rolled out the scroll and they said, this is what the Lord says. 